Hi, this video will detail how I swapped Ethereum in my MetaMask to Avalanche coin and deposited the Avalanche in my MetaMask. This whole process shouldn't take more than 5 to 10 minutes. However, it does require a few things already set up. First, a MetaMask wallet set up with the Avalanche network and installed on a browser like Chrome or Brave. I'll link a video in the description below on how to do that. Second, I need an Avalanche wallet set up to receive the AVAX tokens on the X chain. If you don't know what this means, that's okay. I will explain it in this video. I'll also link a video in the description on how to get a free Avalanche network wallet. Finally, I need some Ethereum in my MetaMask. The first step is to navigate to changenow.io. I'll leave a link in the description for the website. ChangeNow is a trusted non-custodial service created for simple and fast cryptocurrency exchanges. For the first cryptocurrency, select Ethereum. For the second currency, select the Avalanche token or AVAX. When I type in the amount of ETH I want to swap, ChangeNow automatically calculates how much AVAX will result from this swap. I'll calculate at the end of this video how much the entire transaction costed me. Clicking exchange brings me to this page where ChangeNow asks me to input where the AVAX token should be deposited. There's a note here that says only X chain is supported. We do not support C chain for AVAX token. Just as some background, the Avalanche network has three different blockchains, the X, the P, and the C chains. The X chain is for asset exchange, basically moving tokens around and swapping coins. The C chain is for Ethereum compatible smart contracts. If I want to have AVAX in my MetaMask wallet, I will need the AVAX tokens on the C chain. But since ChangeNow will only deposit the tokens on the X chain, I need an intermediate wallet. This is where the Avalanche wallet comes in, and I'll show you that in a second. I need the Avalanche wallet to process X chain transactions. I'll link a video in the description on how to set up a wallet, but I've already done so. Here's my Avalanche wallet, and in this section here, I see the various chain wallet addresses. I need to select the X chain and copy the wallet address. Then I paste the address into the recipient field and change now. Notice the check mark indicating that this is a valid address. I then click next to continue. Change now shows a notification telling me that the network fees are high right now, and that's pretty normal on the Ethereum network. I click I understand and proceed. Here, Change now asks me to confirm the transaction for converting 0.006 ETH to about 0.12 AVAX. Confirming will bring me to this page where Change now awaits a deposit. What Change now is asking me to do is to transfer ETH into an address so that they can process the swap. There's an option here to deposit with Brave Browser. Since I have ETH in my MetaMask extension on my browser, I go ahead and click this button that says Unlock Brave Browser. I need to make sure of a couple of things. One, that my MetaMask is currently connected to the Ethereum mainnet. And two, that I have enough ETH in my wallet to cover gas fees. If I don't have enough to cover fees, MetaMask will tell me and the swap can't go through. I go ahead and click the deposit button and MetaMask will pop up to ask me to confirm the transaction. I click confirm and now I wait a few minutes for MetaMask to deposit the funds for swapping. The status bar should change to confirming after a few minutes. Some more waiting happens before the status changes to exchanging and then finally it finishes on sending to you. The whole process from awaiting the deposit to now took about 5 minutes. Afterwards, I get a success message indicating that the swap was successful. I check my Avalanche wallet to see that the funds have arrived. Now the last step is to move the AVAX tokens from the Avalanche wallet to my MetaMask wallet so that I can use it on various DeFi platforms. On the Avalanche wallet page, I first have to transfer the funds from X chain to the C chain. To do that, I select cross chain on the left, select C chain for the destination chain, input the amount I want to transfer, click confirm, and then click transfer. Now that the funds are on the C chain, I click on send. Make sure that the source chain is the C chain. Input the amount I want to send. Copy and paste my MetaMask wallet address, which is already set up on the Avalanche network. Confirm and send transaction. After a few seconds, a transaction goes through and I check my MetaMask wallet to confirm that the funds are in there. To estimate how much I paid for this transaction, I'm estimating it by using CoinMarketCap. 
0.006 ETH is about $23.20, which is how much I am swapping. And 0.1157 AVAX, which is what I'm receiving, is worth about $12.55. The transactions required for going from the Avalanche wallet to my MetaMask are no more than about $0.20. Cents. So the whole transaction costs $23.20 minus $12.55 plus $0.20 cents plus the gas fee, which is about $9.66. This is a grand total of about $20.51. I always calculate my transaction costs before confirming them to see if it is worth it. And that's it. Let me know if this video helped you out. If you need to swap Ethereum to Avalanche token, use the link in the description below to support this channel. As always, stay safe and thanks for watching.